The Big Bang Theory is being questioned now that the James Webb Space Telescope has provided new information. The telescope recently made an astonishing discovery that is causing a stir in the field of physics worldwide. With one stunning image, it has ended long-standing debates, leaving experts speechless. No more speculation is needed. The Webb Space Telescope's most recent discovery is both visually stunning and a game-changer that could alter our understanding of the universe. What heated argument among experts has this picture finally resolved? How does this beautiful image taken by the James Webb Space Telescope change our perception of the universe? Let's delve into the image that ends the physics debate. One of the main problems in astrophysics is that scientists can't agree on the age of the universe or how fast it is expanding. Scientists of all generations have been puzzled by this unsolved phenomenon and have conducted numerous studies to find answers. Those who study cosmology try to figure out how the universe was created, how it works, how it has changed over time, and how it will eventually end. In the last 100 years, there has been significant progress in this area. The Big Bang Theory, the most popular theory in cosmology, posits that the universe has been expanding for about 13.8 billion years, starting out very hot and dense. The Hubble constant, which indicates how fast the universe is expanding, is used to measure this growth. However, measuring the Hubble constant accurately is challenging. There are two main types of measurements for the Hubble constant, local measurements and measurements from the early universe. Local measurements examine objects in space, such as Cepheid variable stars and type Bia supernovae, which are used as standard candles due to their known brightness. By measuring how the expansion of the universe affects their speeds, astronomers can determine the Hubble constant. The second method involves measuring the early universe's cosmic microwave background, CMB radiation, discovered in the 1960s. This radiation is the afterglow of the Big Bang, seen when the universe was only 380,000 years old. By analyzing the tiny temperature and polarization ripples in the CMB, Astronomers can determine the age of the universe and its rate of expansion. However, these two methods yield different results. Local measurements suggest that the universe is expanding faster than what the CMB data indicates. Scientists have been striving to understand why these results differ. To explore these mysteries, more research is being conducted. The discrepancy suggests that either we are unaware of some new science, or there are errors in one or both measurement methods. The James Webb Space Telescope allows us to see farther into space than ever before. Due to its advanced capabilities, the telescope can reveal elements, planets and galaxies previously thought impossible to observe. Scientists hoped that data from the Webb would help them measure the Hubble constant more accurately. Instead, the first wave of data has complicated matters, providing new information that doesn't align with previous theories. Could this information help us develop a new understanding of space? If so, we may need to rethink our current knowledge of how the universe operates. For example, we might discover new particles and forces or reassess the role of dark energy, the mysterious force accelerating the universe's expansion. As we continue to uncover new information, our understanding of space evolves. One significant discovery was the cosmic microwave background radiation found in 1965, which strongly supported the Big Bang Theory. Before this, scientists believed the universe would last forever and expand at a constant rate. The new evidence contradicted this view. Similarly, the discovery of dark energy in the late 1990s, which influences the universe's expansion, led to significant changes in our understanding. The current challenges in cosmology could lead to groundbreaking discoveries about the universe. These challenges drive the development of better tools for exploring space. Scientists worldwide are deeply invested in this cosmological problem, eager to learn more about the universe. This situation underscores the ever-evolving nature of science as we uncover more about space. Another related concern is the S8 tension, which pertains to the distribution of matter in the universe. This lumpiness, where some regions have dense clusters of galaxies while others are sparse, can be studied using various methods. One approach is gravitational lensing, 
where the different densities of massive objects bend light from distant galaxies, revealing dark matter. Another method involves analyzing the cosmic microwave background to understand the early universe's lumpiness and comparing it to current observations. These analyses reveal discrepancies, suggesting that our understanding of dark matter and its role is still incomplete. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unprecedented sensitivity and clarity, is poised to revolutionize astronomy. It will examine the early universe, shedding light on the formation of the first galaxies and stars, and provide better measurements of the universe's expansion and matter distribution. To answer these critical questions, careful observation and potentially new theoretical methods are required. Discovering more about dark energy, new physics, or understanding dark matter better will have significant implications across various fields. Unraveling the universe's mysteries is like solving a vast, intricate puzzle while blindfolded. Scientists like meticulous detectives are dedicated to uncovering the truth. Project Flamingo, NASA's latest initiative, exemplifies the agency's growing interest in scientific exploration. Utilizing one of the world's most powerful supercomputers at Durham University in Britain, this project aims to study the universe with a focus on dark matter. Project Flamingo takes a unique approach, incorporating a wide range of cosmic phenomena, from stars and black holes to galaxies with varying gas content. The goal is to comprehensively understand the universe, particularly the elusive dark matter that doesn't emit, absorb, or reflect light, but is believed to exist due to its gravitational effects on visible matter. Scientists remain baffled by its elusive nature. In conclusion, the discoveries and projects driven by advanced technologies like the James Webb Space Telescope and Project Flamingo highlight the relentless pursuit of knowledge in understanding the universe. As we learn more, our theories and methods evolve, leading to groundbreaking insights and a deeper comprehension of the cosmos. Why data that don't seem to match up with the structure of the universe are causing cosmic conflicts? Differences in measurements like these show that we don't fully understand how the world works right now. If you want to compare these metrics to types of music, jazz and classical are like these metrics. Each has its own style but is still linked. Flamingo tries to bring these different points of view together and help us all understand the universe better. But even though it was complicated, the cosmic strain stayed. This conflict still exists as humbling proof that we haven't figured out a lot of the mysteries in the world. It looks like the world doesn't want to share its secrets with us right now. We get a bigger and bigger set of problems to solve as we add more data points and modeling models to our toolbox like Flamingo. Every time you find an answer, it brings up new questions, which makes the search never ending. It shows that our quest to figure out the mysteries of the world is complicated and always changing. In the early 1900s, Edwin Hubble made the amazing finding that the universe is expanding. Since then, our understanding has grown at an amazing rate. The Big Bang Theory, dark matter, and dark energy are just a few of the new things scientists are finding out about the size and shape of the world. They looked into the galaxy by looking at the cosmic microwave background, CMB, and carefully writing down the galaxy's places and speeds with more and more detail. It's like getting another important piece of the universe puzzle. With each of these big steps, we are now more motivated to learn and try to understand the universe better. Because of this, the world is, in fact, very mysterious, and it might not be a good idea to reveal its truths too soon. In the 1990s, however, astrophysicists found something very surprising. The universe is not only growing, but it is also expanding faster. Because of this surprising finding, scientists came up with the idea of dark energy, a mysterious force that pushes things in the universe apart. The Flamingo Project became an important player in this field because it provided more than just a normal supercomputer exercise. As a very realistic virtual reality model of the universe, it used information from the cosmic microwave background, CMB, and measurements of galaxies to make a digital picture of the whole thing. At each stage of their research, scientists add new questions, revised models, and better ideas. 
The theory that the Big Bang Theory puts forward was once very controversial, but now it is seen as an important part of scientific knowledge. In the same way, dark matter is no longer just an idea. It is a real part of the puzzle. Dark energy is an unknown force that is driving the expansion of the universe. It was discovered in the late 20th century and is now one of the most important parts of understanding the universe. Also, tools will keep getting better as we explore space and learn more about how the universe works. Glad you watched another episode. Click the video on your screen to see more mind-blowing videos like this one while you're still here.